The world made for hearing people. They don't hear us, see us, we're like invisible. As a child, nobody understood me. I stopped there with my high school dance teacher who believed that the spirit of dance is in everyone. So she said, go ahead and dance. Help me express myself. Then save my life. Deaf people have a unique culture. We have so much to offer, but so often we are just left out. I created the Barrier International Deaf Dance Festival to create a community to share what I've learned, to create a space where people around the world can dance and express themselves and be heard. For me, the studio is like a temple where you can do the religion that you love. When you lose your temple, like we did during the core of it, you will realize that you can create it anywhere you want. Am I black first or deaf first? When George Floyd died, it was like my brother died. When I was 13 years old, I was in Oakland. Suddenly, there was all these cops around me, and they had my hand behind my back. I didn't understand what was happening. I was shaking. I didn't know what discrimination was, but I knew that there was something wrong. The feelings are unexplainable. To be black is to be a target. To be black and deaf, it was more dangerous. I can't understand what the cop are saying or they're commanding me to, to do something. I can't understand them. So every time I leave my home, I'm afraid. I'm scared. When I dance, people start to weep. I don't even understand what's happening to them, but I know that I have to keep going. I hope that people recognize each other during these times. I want to see the world where people give each other time, listen, and express themselves fully as they know how to express themselves. I'm a servant to the community. I'm a human being who happened to be an after them, a dancer, and deaf who love helping people.